Hi everyone, the Pokemon Fan 993 here, back with more Pokemon Shining Pearl. During the last episode, we made our way through a foggy route, battled a crap ton of trainers, and got Ryu to pick up some very good items that might be useful later in the game. So, with that, I think this is toward, um, yeah. So, we are now in Celestic Town. If I remember right, this is in a very big town, so let's, first thing we're going to do is we're going to heal up. Alright. <clears throat> Heal up. No, I didn't want to talk to you again. But bringing a place so far off the beaten path, there's nothing here to see but some ancient Pokemon etching. Now this is, now this is entering limit to see your Pokemon. Pray wish you very much you can have this. You obtain a great ball. It's about trust between the trainer and the Pokemon. The only trust is that each other is the key to victory. This town has been here since Sinnoh was made. Okay. <clears throat> Celestic Town. The past lives. There's an odd spaceman for the ruins. There's anything there, but he, he, they only, that only seemed to make him angry. He, think he, he will blow up the town with a bomb. The nerve of it all. But we never reported that Pitch Mason was my Pokemon. Probably not time to bet, so I'm just gonna walk around a bit. Hey, do you know what they say? Say Pokemon created this little region. <clears throat> Happy me. Dang it, I didn't mean to walk outside. Get back in there. I must bear and down and train, and for that time is unimportant. Therefore, I have no need for a watch. Take this from me. You've seen the Analog Watch Pokemon app. So I'm a Pokemon. The Analog Watch displays the current time. But basically just dis displays it in a format that a lot of people probably wouldn't even use, because it's sad to say people don't know how to, I know some people don't even know how to, how to read one of those clocks. Let's see if I can find it real quick. I used to teach at schools. I'm not sure they do that no more. Yeah, here's the analog, so it's actually here. It's it says seven. Huh. It actually is the right time. Um, must be because it's not going off my computer. <clears throat> anyway. And that was just for before I go down there. There's another route over there. There's no Pokemon in this town. It said you could buy until items in the house right next to me. Oh, okay. Maybe they build one here then. Help them, may I help you? Grab some great balls. We're gonna need some of those. I have no Pokeballs, that's for sure. Do I have any revives? Five. Let's grab some more uh, uh, status healing items. Might need those. I have enough money anyway to do just about anything. Let's get a new outfit, of course. Grab two of those. I think I'm good on. Oh, we can my super repels here. Grab one of those. All right. What does this guy next door do? Did you just handle the register? Oh. Oh yeah, she sells the other Pokeballs. Ooh, timer balls. Those are gonna be very useful. Let's grab a bunch of those. It's useful for more turns to go by, so I'm gonna buy 20 of them. Um, how's my dust balls looking, by the way? I got two premier balls for that. All right, good. How about this guy? Putting on a pair of glasses changes how the world looks. Putting on a pair of glasses changes how the world looks. Too deep, man. So does it change the world that looks your Pokemon? You can't have a pair of black glasses. Sunlight is bright in the day, how about a pair of black glasses? Black glasses raise the power of dark type moves. <clears throat> I think that's all I can really see here. I think there's another yeah, there's another house here. A oh, lovely thick run. It's not even uh, any any of the leaders either. My sister's are studying the myths of Sinnoh. She wants to know how people in Pokemon interacted in the days of myths. Or things different back then, or the same as they are now. Say it's focus of research. If you guys go actually watch uh, the movie Arceus and the Jewel of Life, which is a Gen 4 movie, you actually can get a bit of a peek on, on that subject. So no both of you began reading it. Back when, when Pokemon was born, intelligence bloomed among us, enriching our lives. The Pokemon was born, emotions bloomed among us, giving us joy and sorrow. The Pokemon was born, willpower bloomed among us, spurring us into action. 
Where are you from? Totally kind of say, isn't that close to like Verity? But like I said, to be home to mess, but to being in emotion, it must look over, it must be looking over you. Howdy, studying on the local history. Pretty short line. <clears throat> if I come to Mount Coronet, will I be able to see all of Sinnoh? Mount Coronet towers at the center of Sinnoh. In a way, it's the closest place to the sky in this region. Alright, let's go deal with that team grunt then. The galactic grunt. But there's something over here, isn't there? I think there would be, considering there's nothing. Is there an item here? No, that's weird. Hmm, oh well. Sounds insignificant. There's nothing about you, it doesn't need to be exist. I'm gonna blow up with a galactic bomb. If you're mess with me, I'll shut you down with a Pokemon battle. Is really gonna be a mess with me? Well, yeah, you're gonna frickin' blow up the entire world. I didn't catch what he said because I was talking over it, but nothing probably that important. Let me guess you have a Zubat. No, but you a beautiful. That's better than a Zubat. This is my new Evolved Pilly. Ice Beam. One shot. Quick while activate so I go first, too. I do look like they made a separate arena for the uh, Galactic Grunts in this game, though. Or Team Galactic in general, I mean. Pro good level 38. HG by 3, attack and defense by 2, special attack by 3, special defense by 1, and speed by 2. Sheriff good level 39. Every step by 2. Pro gun. Does it have. What, what ability does it have? Okay, so it might know, um, it might know Dry Skin, so I'm going to go for an Ice Beam instead. Dry Skin will restore HP, it says deal damage to it. And if it has no full HP, it would just do no damage. So I made a good, I think I made a good decision there. You defeat Team Galactic Grunt. Better out just blow me up with a bomb. I got worked over and by a kid, no less. What does a 296 for winning? Too much to handle. Whatever, I'm out of this war horse town. There's nothing to do here anyways. I can't move. I'm guessing someone's coming to meet me. Yep. Why aren't you to quit the train? That was magnificent. This is the Ellis Lesson Town. I, I give you my thanks. Oh, that old charm, eh? See that deer? What's they say? It says he has trusted you to build it to me. It's Cynthia. She's my granddaughter. Hand over the old charm to the elder. The old charm is something made in Calistic Town long, long ago. I mean, our mythical deity said to have created Sinnoh. The old charms are still discovered now and again. As you should down, why not look around inside the ruins? You examine the ancient cave painting. Mysterious designs cover a whole section of the wall. There's some strange things forming a triangle in the middle of them is a shining sphere. What is this all about? Cave painting reminds me of an old story. If this is a being, a being so powerful it's considered to be a deity at the time. Opposing this being were three Pokemon. They kept the three kept balance with the one as if they formed a triangle. It's an ancient legend of Sinnoh that's still told to this day in Plastic Town. Oh yes, I thought them useful if you take these. Well, my granddaughter, but she's not using them. You obtain TM-95. Serve the head move app allows you to move across the surface of water. Nice. Each of the TMs contains surf. The user controls a huge wave, drags everything around, except for the user itself, and attacks. Because my granddaughter said something about... What was it? Oh, yes, you can use surf in your pro guides to cross water, such as seas or rivers. Use the head move for the field, however, you must obtain the Heart Home Gym Badge. On that matter, you'll have to, you'll have to handle it my, yourself, I'm afraid. So is that my next badge that I have to get? It feels like I should probably. Yeah, it's the next badge I have to get. So I can go to Heart Home now and basically just uh, go and beat her. I know she's a ghost type leader, so um, uh, dealing with her might be slightly difficult. I do have my own ghost ghost type, but ghost types are weak to ghost type moves. There appears to have been an extended like, struggle here. Every sh Everyone should step back and view things from a bigger perspective. It's bigger perspective that one is on a universal scale. My name is Cyrus. I seek the power to create a new world. A new world. World, a, new, a world without strife. However, the power seems to be unavailable here. We met before, yes. I, I, it was on Mount Coronet. We discover any power derived from the legend of Sinnoh in for me. But that power is needed to create my new world. 
Can someone figure it out by now? It's the second time we saw the guy. He's actually um, a member of Team Blessed. He has the sticker and everything. So what I was saying earlier is that my team, this might be one of my harder gym battles just because I have no Pokemon that are weak, strong against Ghost, except for obviously Dread herself, or himself. Um, in order to get Dread to evolve, I need a Dust Stone, and I believe you can't get them until very late in the game. Unless Rio picks one up, he picked up the Shiny, shiny Stone last, uh, last time. It's a fair possibility. Okay, I don't think there's is really any. I can go the other way, I think. Uh, uh, west. Route 211. Two Grippa Berries. Two Ipapa Berries. There's a few trainers littered around here. Two Aspar Berries. Or Aspir, however you pronounce it. And two Peach Berries. Plant two Peach Berries. I gotta say, considering they overhauled the graphics in the game, the load time in this game, except for like when you're trying to get into the game originally, is because there's no continue menu actually. But other than that, it loads pretty well. You know what I mean? Like all the other games, there's always like a continue new game and all that. But I think I guess you uh, they didn't think that was necessary for Switch. They just made it so if you wanted to delete your profile, you have to basically go into your your Switch setting and um and what do you call it? And basically just uh, they all got watered and just delete the save file from your uh from your uh, switch itself, or the memory card, or whatever you're using, what you're ever using your current memory for. Right, let's go around here. Mm -hmm. Go everywhere, knocked out. We're gonna show you the, show you our best, huh? Oh, our best. Oh, how clever. I was waiting for a stupid pun to come up like that. Probably took this one for one that actually show up. Catherine. Catherine set out knocked out. Go figure. He has knocked out and made a knocked out joke. <clears throat> Hex will not have no effect on um, Knocked Owl because of it being a normal type, so we're going for Psybeam. Oh, that didn't do jack. Switch to Fusion, though. And it hurt itself, that's good. And I thought it was actually a bit bulkier than you think it would be. If I have a third evolution, then might it might be worth putting an evil aid on him using for battles like that, but probably not gonna happen. Active sensor, that is a strong psychic type move. But Dread's defense is pretty high. Special defense too. This is the first Pokemon I've, I've actually had a decent amount of struggle with. Okay, so Sky Attack basically charges up the first turn and hits the next turn for like 150 damage, which is almost double what um, Extra Sensory does. But if I knock him out this turn or I confuse and hurt himself, then the attack will not go through. Of course, he snapped out of it. That might knock out Dread. Nope. I'm almost tempted to try Mr. Viz with Evil Light and see if that works really well against uh, just in general. You defeated Bird Keeper Kathleen. Kathleen? We did our best. That's what matters, right? We'll go to 364 for winning. I'm strong, I'm strong. 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 Am I really? No, I am strong. I'm strong. Okay, I'm all good to go. Why, you startled me good. You don't understand what I'm doing when I see Moon Contain the TM. I think TM77. I'm glad that he gave me something for that because that was annoying as shit. Let me explain how the move works without getting too technical. Let's say your opponent has raised its defense using Harden. The Pokemon can use Spec Up to get the same defense boost as its opponent. Basically, your Pokemon gets the same status boost as its target. While exploring the ruins, I spotted a trainer. I must investigate. You are challenged by Rune Maniac Harry. Carries to out Bronzor. Dread. I think Hex is super effective. Yep. That should be a one shot, I think. It does Pookie Play, so its Hex gets even stronger. Yep. No Sturdy either. Dread 
Red with level 38. HP by 3, attack by 1. Defense, special attack, special attack, speed by 2. <coughs> oh, guys, for that, sneeze. Yeah. How to level 38. HP by 3, attack by 2. Defense by 1. Special attack by 1. Special defense, speed by 2. How to turn orange taunt. No, I don't think I'm going to need that. You feed Rune Maniac Carry. The investigators are able to the, the trainer to be tough. 1680 for winning. There's a cave here. And there's a ninja boy right there. The ninja's best weapon. Can you keep up? You are charged by Ninja Boy Nick. Scruffy. It's a ball form is poison dark. I'm not sure. Um, what typing is like this? I think it's, it's, uh, yeah, it's just poison. So it's a side will do a bunch of damage. I'll have to use gold back. Seeing out that side only strong again. Almost knocked it out. Confused him. Nice. Screech. Defense. Press defense harshly fell. Side beam. Go back, painted. You're defeating Ninja Boy Nick. I did a lot to conceal myself, too. 432 for winning. That's the other way to mount Coronet. Must be. Is there anything down there? Let's check. Oh, there is someone down here. Aha! Ha, ha, I'm too- I'm psyched this. Here, here goes. You defeated your turn by Blackout Team. Team. Gone. Someone told me that saying it like that is Sean, but I think it's actually Seen. Not sure. Anticipation. Posing Progunk Shuttered. Psybeam. Super effective. Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch always lets you go first and it will always attack the opponent as long as you're using an attack move. You're about to use Suffuse Ray and or Meme Look at one of us worked. Macho. I beam again. A Pokemon is rather weak to second moves. Focus energy. Probably don't have anything that's gonna hurt me anyway, unless it has knockoff. Not gonna matter anyway, this is over. I got one more Metatite. Mad Titan fainted. He'd be a black belt scene. I'm gonna call him scene. I don't know get why we can't win. 928 for winning. Is that a better trainer? That's too far out of line? Oh shit. Let's see if there's anything around him. I guess there isn't. Oh, speaking of Mad Titan, there's another one. Let's head to Mount Coronet. I think that's where, like, where it is. Fine. Trainer tip. Even vendors can get lost inside Mount Coronet. Trainers should check their supply of medicine ends before they venture through. Alright, let's throw a max or a super repel, whatever we got, because this is going to be a pain in the butt, I think. Max repel. 
I don't want to get countered by 90, 90 Pokemon or whatever. Okay. Alright, I need the Poke. For this. Dang it. 20. What I want. I guess I need to teach it. Do I need to teach it? That's weird. I thought... I didn't have to teach it. That's weird. I guess I'll give it to Totter, but... Am I not allowed to use strength yet? It's weird. I guess it's slightly stronger than Slash. That's weird, though. Why would that one need to be taught? Might not even need to be taught. Maybe I'm just being stupid. Yeah, I can't use it. What? Yeah, I can't... What the heck? Okay, that makes no sense whatsoever. No, get the freaking thing back up there. Dang it. Okay, I don't know what the, what the hell's going on with that, but whatever. Can't go this way either, because there's another freaking boulder block in the way, and I can't even use strength for some goddamn reason. Whatever, let's just get out of here. I don't know if that's a glitch or whatever, but that's some bull crap. Unless you need surf... Unless you unless you need to be stupid and you have to have... That badge to go do, use strength and surf, it doesn't make any sense either. Most badges only want you to control one. Heal up. I guess strength is technically strength tends to make stronger, but the slash other effect might make it stronger, but I guess nothing I can do about that now. Alright, let's go. Where's the gym? Is it over here? How's there? How's, hey there, how's it going, champ to be? Gym Winner is a user of Ghost Type Pokemon. Where normal type moves have no effect on, at all on Ghost Pokemon. Ghost, it's not the there, but you have to see it for yourself. Go on, go get him, Challenger, I believe in you. Hmm. Oh, one of these things, okay. 3 plus 5 plus 7, that's... That's, uh, 15. I'm gonna go to the wrong way. I just battle trainers, okay. Hey, you throw the quiz so you get to battle with me, right? Actually, that's actually the case. I don't think any NPC would really say that. I'm just doing this for experience now. I need as much as I can. Mr. Viz, ironically. You want a female or a male? Is it both male? Nope. Hey, look, it's your sister, Dread. Your brother's stronger. There's gonna be a lot of, I think there's gonna be a lot of gym trainers here, but I'm not worried about that. You defeated the last Molly. But you wanna take it easy or anything? Gee. 720 for winning. You're a gym trainer, you should be expecting to fight Pokemon. So the right, right one's obviously the, the right door is obviously the right one, but I'm gonna head this way. Battle another trainer. Did you have Poketch or did you screw up deliberately? I screwed up deliberately, actually. I forgot you could use the poke etch, but I'm, I mean, that's a basic map from you. really don't need a freaking pen and paper for that one. I mean, I guess you were a kid, you were, you were 10 years old, I guess, maybe, but I know I'm not. Hex. Powered up by the spooky play and super effective. Her. That might be slightly faster than me, I'm not really sure. But it's faster than Dread. Nope, still faster. Yep, 
defeat Youngster Donnie. Oh, I was done in. 96 or 96 for winning. Let's go to the correct door now. Correct, congratulations. Oh, well, I actually that wasn't correct because I went to this one last, but yeah, I guess that's technically the correct answer. Went to the right door. Hey, what's this now? What is 12 foot? That's 40, so the middle door is the right one. But let's go to the left and right door to get experience. Been, I've been to all sorts of places, that means I know a ton of things. You're joined by Camper Drew. I think the title of this video is actually going to be just called A Bomb with a question mark because uh, what the most interesting thing that happens there is that guy telling everyone he's going to blow the entire town up. Dreadwood low 39, HP and attack by 2, defense by 1, special attack by 2, special defense by 2, and speed by 3. Ghastly. Powder is not really suited for this gym, and uh, I think that's about it. So Powder's probably going to be put in the back burner for a while while I just deal with this gym. Ghastly. Bubble Beam. <clears throat> Ghastly fainted. Another Ghastly. And that's it. You'd be a camper Drew. Yeah, whatever. You can battle, too. Those are important for winning. So what he's going to do is he's going to tell me that he's obviously smarter than me. And if there's a new place I can find a new kind of format, so I'll be a know-it-all. Kind of come off as one kid. Um, so Tyler's going to be in the back because, you know, can't do much. I'm going to put Hilly up front. Let's head to the other door. The wrong one again. Get more experience. I'm not afraid of pick nicking anywhere, so I've learned all sorts of things. New challenge by pick and nicker Shellane. Shellane? Driftwood. Someone told me they couldn't get... Because in this game, you went to see Pokemon or the rest of them in your deck. Someone told me that they went for the correct answer in here, therefore they missed Drift seeing Drift Loon to put in their deck, and they had to wait till Friday. Like, like, well, I mean, I understand you want to get through the game, but you also need the experience in order to be easier with the game later on, so... Mischievous. Or Mischievous, however you pronounce it. Bubble Bean. Wow. But I thought his defense really is high. Didn't do much to me though from a psychic type, but it might have confused me. Nope, didn't confuse me. Thought it might have, but Aqua Jet. Did you finish it off? Yep. Pillager to level 39. HE by 3 attack, defense, special attack, special defense, and speed by 2. Whirlpool. Nah. Kazer go to level 40. H by 3 attack, defense by 1, special attack by 2, special defense by... Special attack by 2, special defense by... Special attack by 3, special defense by 2, and speed by 3. Roleplay. I... Is that, is that the one that copies... Yeah, copying the Carvis ability. The, co the Carvis ability. Nah. Pick a nigger Shaleen. You're tough, this is something new to me. 222 for winning. Okay, I'm about done with this episode, so we're gonna actually just kind of pop out here, and we're gonna go through the. I'm gonna rearrange my Pokemon just a little bit, and then we're gonna go through the right door. A real pit of revive, nice. More good stuff.
prep, congratulations. It was probably a division problem or something stupid. Anyway, this is for this video. Thank everyone for watching. This is a Pokemon fan, uh, 1993, signing off. I'll see you guys in the next... Come on. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.